Okay, this is one of the past year questions for integration and yeah, this is the paper 2 question actually will give you 8 to 10, 10 marks depends on the questions Okay, so let's have a look on the, this diagram and this question First, he said diagram 2 show the straight line y equal to x plus 4 Intersect, yeah, intersecting the curve y equal to x minus 2 square at the point A and B Me actually this curve is integrating with this straight line at two points point A and point B okay and then first A part A he asks us to find the values of K yeah so in order to find the values of K we okay we have to use the intersection point methods to find so you when you got the intersection point okay so the way you can find the coordinate is you substitute y into the y means actually this is called the stimulus equation methods so what i do in order to find the coordinate b which is the x value for k so uh, i will substitute i will substitute y into the y okay so in order to make it understand easier okay so uh, maybe i can write here okay for part a okay I put y equal to x plus 4 equal to, is the first one and then y equal to x minus 2 square is the second one and then I substitute the first one into the second one so therefore I will got x plus 4 will equal to x minus 2 square and then what, what I should do is and then I open up okay i open up i will got x plus 4 will equal to x square minus 4x plus 4 and then i, I simplify move everything to this side here make here become zero so x move here we will got x square minus 4x and minus one more x minus 5x and then 4 and 4 actually we, we can straight away cancel out so we will got after that we have to factorize out uh, x we got x minus 5 here so therefore we've got two coordinates for x x will equal to 0 or x will equal to 0 or x will equal to 5 because x minus 5 equal to 0 therefore x will equal to 5 so from here actually we can know that they are in this, this curve and this straight line the intersection in two coordinate on x first is x equal to 0 which is here intersect for point a x equal to 0 another one point another one x equal to 5 which is for k so from here i can straight away write therefore k is equal to 5 okay so i just do a remark here k is equal to 5 okay part b as usual the question will ask you to find the area of the shared region p which is this this area he want to find this area okay most of the student will think that you straight away integrate this curve you can get this area then you are wrong because when you integrate this curve when you integrate this curve you only can get this area Okay, I just roughly draft out here. Okay, let's say you integrate from 0 to 5. Your k is equal to 5. You integrate for this curve y equal to x minus 2 square. You integrate this curve, you only can get this area. Because the curve, okay, when we do the integrate towards the x axis, we actually we, we can get the area which is below below the curve. Means when we connect the curve to the x axis, means you only can get this area. It's not this area. So therefore, in order to get this area, you will see a trabezium here. Do you see a trabezium here? Okay, you use the trabezium 
minus this area then you can get this area because we will have the trabezium here so this is the trabezium so do you see the trabezium we use the trabezium minus the red color part we can get the middle part okay so here we have to use the trabezium minus the red color part then we can get the shirt region p okay if you got the idea then maybe i can start to do i can start to do now okay so in order to get the area of the shirt region so for part b okay he want area of the shirt region okay so here you know to you find trabezium trabezium formula will be 1 over 2 a plus b multiple height okay so therefore 1 over 2 a plus b is two parallel line which is this line and this line plus together and then multiple the height okay now the issue is okay we have to find out okay what is height for here okay so means if you want to get the coordinate b actually you can straight away substitute k equal to 5 into this equation so let's say if you substitute k in okay you want to get coordinate b so we substitute we, we got the x coordinate is 5 right now so we want to find y so i substitute 5 into here so y will equal to 5 plus 4 which is 9 right now 5 plus 4 which is 9 okay and then same thing we want to find uh, the coordinate for a okay a here a here the x axis is zero so we got this one is zero so y will be okay so when x this straight line when x equal to zero y will be equal to four so this is called zero four okay so from the information here we know the length here the length for here will be four and then length for here will be nine okay look at the y value okay and then the height here actually is five okay if you got all the information it's very easy to uh, for us to find the area of trabezium so one over two nine plus four and then multiple h h is five height so the total will be we've got this is 13 13 multiple 5 we've got 60 uh, 65 65 divided by 2 and divide by 2 unit square okay and then we have to minus and then we have to minus the the bottom part means we have to find find the area for the bottom part which is we have to integrate so the whole thing we minus okay so this is for shared region i write the short form shared region okay we have to minus integrate okay this one obviously integrate from 0 to 5 so i write 0 to 5 here when i say you on the x exit you on the x axis straight away behind you write dx mean when you see dx mean you have to integrate y therefore therefore 65 unit we have to minus what is the y for the curve curve will be x square minus 2 so i just expand this one okay then we can integrate easily this one called x square minus 4x plus 4 okay so therefore we integrate okay x square square is 2 2 plus 1 is x cubed divided by 3 and then minus 4x 4x x is power of 1 1 plus 1 we got x 2 divided by 2 and plus 4 mean plus 4x and then we write the 5 and 0 here okay so continue doing then we have got the 65 divided by 2 minus okay then yeah then we substitute the 5 into all the x okay then we substitute the 5 into all the x we have got 1 2 5 divided by 3 minus 4 multiple 5 5 squares 25 25 this one will be okay 25 multiple 4 is 100 
divided by 2 okay which is 50 okay plus 4 multiple 5 we will got plus 20 and then we have to minus you substitute all the zero here actually we have got zero we minus zero okay after that you just simplify you just solve this equation you can get it so this is 65 divided by 2 minus okay here 50 negative 50 plus 30 we got negative 30 negative 30 okay so one two five this is negative 30 so we change to same denominator become negative 90 so this one we will get 65 over 2 minus 1 2 5 this one we will got 35 over 3 and then make both of them have, have the same denominator and yeah use calculator will be easier so 65 divided by 2 minus 35 divided by 3 yes we have got 1 2 5 divided by 6 units square so this is the shared region for p okay after that for part c part c he want to find the volume generators in the terms of pi means you can leave your answer in the pi okay when the shared region q now they are saying the shared region q is revolved through 360 about the x axis mean actually this one he will turn 360 on the x axis so when he turn 360 on the x axis okay so i just refresh a little bit mean actually this area he will turn like this so we have to write like integrate okay pi r square correct or not so pi r so where is the r here r here will be the y this one will be r correct or not so pi y square and then because the height here height here is on the x axis therefore dx okay so in order to find uh, we have to integrate the high zero to this point so we have to find what is the coordinate for this point then we only can know from zero to what so here means this curve he will touch touch as this touch as the x axis when y equal to zero okay this is something like coordinate so when y equal to zero y equal to zero x will equal to two because x minus two will equal to zero okay x minus two equal to zero so x will equal to 2 here so we integrate from 0 to 2 okay so if you can understand this one so then I can show you how to do okay okay if you're able to write out this one pi okay integrate 0 to 2 pi y square okay pi y square y now will be x minus 2 power of 4 so we uh, yeah so x minus 2 square we square again so will be 2 multiple 2 we got power of 4 dx okay if you cannot write out this one you please go and watch my previous video which is I will mention there is like it's the integration for volume and area and it's the explanation part you go and you, you go to, you go through the whole video you give you the idea how you have to write out this formula okay okay if you after you write out this one because this one is pi multiple the x minus 2 power of 4 so actually this is multiply mean I can take out pi I take out pi outside after that then only I integrate okay I integrate this one x x minus 2 power of 4 4 plus 1 is 5 so we divide by 5 and then we in the we differentiate inside one more time and then write on the bottom this one x here is uh, if we differentiate here we got 1 so we put 1 on the bottom so here will be 0 2 okay therefore we will got pi okay so this one 2 minus 2 we have got 0 0 divide everything 
is zero. Zero power everything is zero. So the first thing we got zero minus. Okay, the second one we put the zero in, into the x. Zero into x. Zero minus two is we got negative two. Negative two power of five we got negative thirty two. And then divided by five. So therefore, zero minus negative thirty two over five we got plus. So pi multiple thirty two over five. Therefore, the answer will be thirty two over five pi unit cube. Okay. I really hope this video can help you understand more about the integration. Yeah, so you have to understand what is the meanings by revolt through 360 degree about the x as it means actually this, this shared region he will turn 360, you will turn the 360 here. So you should be able to see the cylinder and then you can use the pi r square method, pi r square h method to write down this formula. After you can write out this one, then you can easily find the answer by substitutes everything into it okay for me i think the integration part the hardest part is most of the students cannot cannot write out this one and then they cannot differentiate whether they want to integrate on the x acid or want to integrate on the y acid okay if you feel very confused about that please go and search the the previous videos called integration for area and vol volume and i will mention there is explanation part okay go and find out that video okay that's all for this video thanks for watching